all I had to do was pull down my top. What the fuck? What the, what the, all I had to do was break the two straps on the side. Of the, the dog got pampers too, so I ain't know who pampers in the world. It's pampers all over that yeah. motherfucker. Jerry. All right, everybody. How are you guys doing? Good. Good. So, how are you? I'm good. I'm good. I went to the place last night and then he act like a jerk as always, called the police and act like a fool. Tell me I couldn't step foot on his property. So I hide it. I didn't say anything to him. And today the sheriff put the 24 hours on his door. Ooh, they coming to get his butt in 24 hours. His butt gonna be kicked out by Friday. Y'all hear that? <laughs> So, guess what? Yes. Oh, Friday, he's going to be gone. That's what he was doing. So, I want to ask y'all something. How can somebody get kicked out of their own house? Exactly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and as soon as the, the, the sheriff put the note in the door, he snatched it off. I was going to take a picture. He snatched it off. <laughs> you know? He snatched it so off. I was there. He started cursing at me. You will be stopping there to record. Absolutely. I will oh, take I know you on are. Friday. I will not Please. go to work on Friday just so I can do that. Because <laughs> this is epic. We need this. We need this. Oh, yes. So for yes. the ones yes. that just came in and did not hear, Big Belly Skeezer has been officially served a 24-hour notice as of today. Am I correct? Oh. Okay. And yes, absolutely. It down so she can't take a picture of it. So he will have to vacate tomorrow. She will be videotaping everything so we can get this lab. This is going to be mm. Vigo's headland news. Uh, Big Belly Skis are getting walked off of his own so-called property. <laughs> now, well, yeah. Escorted. He's getting, <laughs> getting walked out. He's getting escorted off the property on Friday. Mm -hmm. So he's mm. yeah, he has 24 hours to remove all this junk. Okay. And then by Friday, they're gonna the sheriff gonna go there. And if he's still there, they're gonna escort him out and dump his junk on the sidewalk. Just like a homeless jerk, like he is. Yeah, he's hear done. That? Oops, hey, super hours, 24 hours, which is tomorrow. Big Belly Skeezer mm -hmm. will be getting walked out by the bailiffs, and Jerry will be recording that. Oh. Now, yes, I will. Mr. We got some. We got. I know everybody got questions and and needs some answers. Um, didn't he tell everybody this was his property? Mm -hmm. yes. That's what I. That's what I, I guess. Heard. JF, he I guess JFJ Properties it is. I, I didn't know that I made a company for him. I didn't know that. <laughs> so <laughs> let me ask you this. When he was in court talking about all this company stuff to the judge, can you give us a little brief of the hearing? Let's wait till she come back because we want to get some details on the hearing. Patiently waiting. I think in he just filed a response. In my divine voice. This is a lot. <laughs> this is a lot. It this was a, a, a whole lot. Right now. I cannot wait this to is too much. Jerry will be right back. Don't worry, y'all. She coming right back. We finna get into this. We finna get into the hearing of what... Hold this on. We gotta, make, we gotta make room for Troller. I gotta drop... Uh, let me get Troll up here because we celebrating. Let me yeah. get Jerry back up here. I'll bring you back up to Son of Man, but hey, this right here. Oh, troll him. <laughs> oh, you Peace, What's up, Trolla? This was officially <clears throat> served a 24-hour vacay notice today, meaning he has to be off the property tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And Jerry will be there to record all of that. So now let's get into the hearing. How did the hearing go? Or was you there or was your lawyer there? How would you like would you like to see the paper? 
I'm going to flash it. Yes, real quick. honey. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes, Give yes. me one second. Let me find that paper. Oh, yeah, Let me find that beautiful that piece of this. paper. Let me find oh, that yes. beautiful piece of paper that the court sent me. Where is that beautiful okay. piece of paper? Where is my paper? I'm going to flash it to you guys real quick and show you guys where did my girls put my paper. Now, Devon, I like to say that uh, uh, the, the Big Belly Skeezer, he, he, I'm in uh, I'm in Florida as well, and the Big Belly Skeezer has 24 hours to remove his things, and then they have 72 hours to uh, uh, come and change the locks, which uh, uh, Jerry is going to have to do. She's going to have to go over there and change the locks. Oh, she's with the, be uh, there. Bar she she's already knows that. Exactly. They're recording. She's gonna the be sheriff there. told her mm -hmm. to meet them there Friday. That's the day they putting his ass out. They already let her yeah, know to come Friday with a lock. Uh, mm. Yeah, she's gonna record him getting escorted. So we will have a, a video of that. Mm -hmm. And it, it'd, be, right. it'd be weird. Everybody's stuff on the side of the road, Devon, is is, is, is very. Uh, it's gonna be a very uh, uh weird and thing it, to it's see. It's pretty expensive to look up there, right? You guys so, ready? Yes, Are you guys ready. ready for this? Everybody mm -hmm. double click Jerry's box so we can see. Double click we the box on here. Okay, let's go. Thank you, Ashley. Oh wait. There you go. I see it. I got it. I see it. Uh -huh. Ooh. That ass out. That yeah, is okay. uh -huh. so, you see that in there? Yes, mm -hmm. I can see all of it. Oh well, big yep. belly skis. I don't know where you're going with your scooter and your broken boat. But thank yeah. you. That's a nice name. I like that. Big belly scooter. So, wait, yeah, you. so let me let me ask you this. Were you in court or not? Or were just your lawyer in court? Oh, just my lawyer went to court. I did not want to see his face. He called me so many times today. He has the nerve to call me at work because I will not answer his phone call. Because he keeps texting me, calling me. I ignore his call. Can you when give I us go a brief there, of the texts that he's sending? What is he saying? He's hey, texting me saying that, oh, call me right away. I care about you. You know, you Haitian like me mm. with family. What? Um, despise it all. You need to call me. I need to help you. This is and that. I ignore him. Then he get mad and he will text me saying that, oh, I'm going to fuck you up. I'm going to take everything you have. I'm going to sue you. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. Oh, you say this. You do He doesn't know what else to say. Mm. Okay. Now, this is a man that wanted to go to court. The judge did not even acknowledge him. Just troop straight wow. through. Wow. Did not even acknowledge him. So let me him. ask you this, Jerry. Did he go back in front of the same judge? The judge will not even look at him. It was the same exact judge, and they did not want to deal with him. Mm. Wow. They did nice. not even want to deal with him. The judge already know him. My friend has 17 eviction right now. And he's looking 17? for a place to stay. 17. I'm number 17. And guess what? In the state of Florida, good luck finding a place. Good mm. luck. Because after you have one eviction, no one wants to rent you. And it's very hard right now to rent in Florida. Everything is sky high. No one's renting to people. And he thinks he's going to find a place. No, no, ma'am. Mm -mm. He can so keep he looking. Need, wow. He need to go back to New York with his mama, huh? Mm -hmm. So If he go to New York, get his butt with for stealing. Mm -hmm. So let me ask you this, Jerry. Did they grant those tenants... Um, what they were um because i know last time i spoke with you i didn't show the people i'm gonna get it up and show mm -hmm. the people where the tenants were making complaints on him and submitted it to the court did the courts yes. acknowledge what the tenants were um typing to her well everything went in there that's what helped the judge not to even bother with him wow. i told you what he did Hell, and I went over there last night, and then oh, he walked in in one of the girl, one of the guys' room, and one of the guy got in his face and screaming. I wish I could have recorded that, screaming at him, screaming. He's just like back off, back off. I'm gonna fuck you, back off. He's just a big pussy. He wouldn't do anything to the guy. And I'm telling you, the guy's like four feet tall, and the guy's shoveling, pushing him with his chest. The same thing I did to him, and he did not do a thing. The guy was screaming at him. He was screaming. He was like, back up, back up. Then he called the police. 
And then when the mm -hmm. police called, they told he went inside, and then the, the cop told him, if you go in that main room again, I'm going to come back and arrest you. Then he goes in the men's room. There was a TV that he sold to the room, to the guy, including an AC, he sold to the guy, and my light that's in the room, he sold to the guy, okay? Wow. And then he told the cop mm. that's his. Mm. So the cop asked me, I said, I don't know. I don't know whose is it. And then the guy pulled up a, a text saying that, listen, this is mine. He sold it to me. Here's when he texts me, tell me that to pay him. He sold the TV for $25 to the guy. I don't know how much he sold the AC. I think I know the $25. And he sold my life for like 10 bucks. Wow. You know, so wow. he, he's so hungry. He's picking my stuff off the yard and keeps selling my stuff. I have a barbecue grill. Yesterday I went, I saw the barbecue grill by the gate about to go i have a door they put the door the, the door by his boat about to go so he's selling everything he took one boat out he put another one in the yard so they still have two boats yeah so two broken up uh, help me please let me help me say that two broken down boat broke so that's what he has broken down so boat he, so when they escort him tomorrow what is he gonna do with these two broken down boats yeah is he gonna drag him down the street or uh somebody gotta pull up for him somebody <laughs> need to pull up on the panel He's somebody recording. need to come up on the panel yep somebody Someone come, come up, up with three. thanks everyone that's gifting anybody somebody come up on the panel so wait a minute hold on thank Let's you get into this shit. so mm -hmm. what all has he sold out of your place so far that you know of he's one of my little motorcycle he destroyed he took all the pieces out he sold the pieces <gasps> he has taken the manifold on the from the car he took the entire um muffler system that i just what? put in for eight hundred dollars he sat out oh, of the car he sold that he took out the copper pipe i was just AC about to ask him did he take the in. copper pipe that. wow he did he did, this and he took, um, took the th copper pipes out. The he, that's yeah. cracking status. Oh, we okay. Ooh, he's so no. hungry, Ooh. he's taking everything and selling everything. I had so I many little areas, sitting areas. She got wow. a yeah, he on that I was just about sugar. to ask if you taking copper pipes, there's some drug activity involved. Like, yeah, and that's him, that's that's him probably calling her because he probably knows she on Bico. Yeah, cause you take. Hold on, let me pipe. call her to make sure to cause he, Haitian yellow threats ain't working. You know that. Hold on. Exactly, like you still, you still getting kicked out Friday. That's crazy, and that's that's a lot of money and taking copper pipes recorded. out. And it's gonna be yeah. recorded. Okay, here's Jerry back. Let's get into okay. it. Jerry is fine as wine. Do y'all hear this? This is how yeah, you gonna take the broken crazy, boat sis. down the street? This is mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, on that <laughs> booger sugar then the crackhead. Yeah, status. talking about <laughs> copper. Yeah, you already know you taking copper pipes. Yep. You know you got some stuff going on. Wow, this is a lot. He's smoking them. Did I say that already? Organic. This is a lot. Yeah, you did. You did. <laughs> you did. Wow. So yeah. let me ask you. That's crazy. This is a lot. We getting to the yeah. bottom of this shit here. <laughs> okay, I'm back. So, so <laughs> from the last I heard, Jerry, his appearance yes. is very awful. Is it still like very awful? Yes, I think he's on you something. Think some, I was just about I to ask you that. You think it's some on something? Yeah, I so think he's on something. With a lot yes, of yes, Yesterday I was talking to all the all the tenants and then he was acting like he was on something. 
And I'm like, you know, uh, crack kills, you know? It's like, oh, no, he's just coke, and that's bad for you, too. I'm like, okay, good for you. Wow. He refused us to talk. He kept recording. We closed the door. We went in. He said it's just coke. Yeah. He said it's just Mm -hmm. coke. And then then he goes and say, oh, that's bad for you, too. I'm like, okay, that's your life. That's your mm-hmm. life. Hey, he has to be doing something. What have he been doing for, with all my money? He keep on. Like, pro- all these tenants. He probably doing fit on and everything. Mm. Okay. All so the tell me, I have, the I have like- 11, I have 11 oh, tenants on the front. So oh. why is he doing, what is he doing with all this money? Plus he has about a, Was in the room sleeping, and then there was people in all the beds. Yep. Did he pay the utilities? Did he ever the, get to pay? The, no, the light bill he make everybody put together to pay for it. The water I pay. Wow. wow. Now, Gary, people want to know: Did he still stink? Was it stinking in the room as well? Still? Oh yeah. Um, he oh yeah. He doesn't shower. He's wearing the same. If you guys, every time you walk, look at him, watch that red shorts. Or black oh. shorts. That's those two that he wears. Yeah, he's so still he, wearing those. He could, Jerry, you telling me he could take those shorts off and they'll stand on their own? That's how old <laughs> sure. they are. Oh my lord! The way Jerry talks, <laughs> like some bitches can walk all uh, munchies. <laughs> <laughs> he's disgusting. Well, you can already look at his ass. He's, he's staying. You're just looking at him. Shit, he's staying. So mm-hmm. you say you wanted to take a picture of the notice and he snatched it down. He yeah, snatched he snatched it, it down. down. He snatched it down. Did he say anything yep. to you? Did he say he wasn't mm-hmm. leaving or did he try to say anything? No. Oh, oh, I got news for you. He said that, oh, I don't care. They can evict me from, from the efficiency. I'll just move to another house. He'll just oh, move to yeah. another house in the property. Like in, in the same, because I have a house in the front, a house in the back, and an efficiency. What? So he said, he'll just gonna move from, from the back house to the front house. What? I hope he does. You hear that? I hope he, he does. Know. Hey, Cola, you hear that? You know he is getting walked off the premises? I hope he does. I hope he does. He's exactly. going to jail. He, he think mm-hmm. he on an island, y'all. He think he could go to different parts of the house. And, and... I don't know where no, he think he, he is. But... Oh, let's tell him about that, Jerry. How he sent the message to his mother and pretend like he was missing and wanted. Oh my God! Sent... Yeah. His mom calling me. He, he first okay. first off first off he sent a message saying that oh they're looking for Jean. Oh uh, this is um this is um Jean's phone. Um, I'm a friend of Jean that got the phone and I'm texting. They're looking for um, cool Haitian. They can find him or he probably off himself or we're going to check the hospital. First of all, mm-hmm. who's going to find your phone when you have a code on your phone to lock your phone? Who's going to text out of your phone? Number one. Mm-hmm. Number two, two days later, his mom called me hysterical, tell me, oh, can you please go check on him for me? Because um, he just sent me an horrible message and he sent an horrible text to his to his sister and we worry. His sister got on the phone. Oh, can you please, please, please? I said, sure, I'll go look. So the mother goes and called me again. Can you please? I say, I can't leave the house right now. I have one of the kids managers that I can't leave. So she called me like about 20 times. Please go, go look because he's not in. So you know what this jerk did? He turned, he turned his phone off. He sent a, a message to his mom, like a suicidal note to his mom and to his sister what? saying that, oh, yeah, that's how fucked up he is. Oh, I'm, I'm, um, oh, I'm, I'm tired. I can't take this life anymore. I think I'm done. Thank you very much. I love you all for everything you have done to, for me. And I really, I'm, I'm apologizing for every, anything I have done, any problem I've caused you guys. But thank you. What? I need to sleep now. He sent that to his mom and to his sister. Then he goes and sent me a message stating that, oh, I hope you're happy. You robbed me of my money. Oh, money is your God. And I'm going to go meet my God. Good luck. I hope you can live with yourself when I'm gone. I ignore his <laughs> ass like there was not even a fly flying by me. I'm like, ah, good. I hope you do it. He ne- Five minutes later, okay. his, mom, his mom kept calling me, calling me, calling me. And, and then the phone ring. It's him calling me. I ignore his call. Then he starts texting me. A bunch of nasty things. Then I call his mom. I say, listen, he's fine because he's texting me and harassing me right now and he's cursing me out. 
Oh my mm. God, thank you, God, thank you, God. No, call him. And the mom's call, he refused to pick up the phone. You see how nasty of a person he is? And mind you, he's saying that his mom has a heart condition. What would you do that to your mother? If you're not oh, yeah, fucked up in yeah. the brain. Okay, Can I ask so, you this, Jerry? So wait, oh, yes, let's, let's get to the people that just came in. Um, Big Belly Skeezer has been officially served a 24-hour vacate the premise notice today, which he has to be gone by the sheriff. tomorrow by the sheriff. And uh, Jerry will be there recording him getting escorted. She's to meet the bailiff over there. But mm -hmm. go ahead with your question, and then we'll figure okay. out what Go ahead, sir. Jerry, do you know by any chance why he has stopped coming to Bigo? He has not been on Bigo. Yeah, we, we guys probably run him off. <laughs> probably too much truth is coming out. He can't handle it. You have to understand mm. this man. This is the way that he operates. He lies and lies and lies and lies and lies. Did he tell you guys he owned an airplane? Because he told me that lie too. Yeah, he, he tried yes. to tell us that also, before. When he was 21. Me, and he also tell me, uh-huh, well, yeah, right, mm -hmm, sure. Yeah, <laughs> anyway, he also tell me and everybody else that the reason why he went to jail twice because he was washing money for drug dealer. I hope a drug dealer grabbed him for that shit because that's a lie. The reason why he went to jail is because he was doing the same thing he's doing. he did to me, scamming people, taking people's money, and rent them places that does not exist. That's what he was doing. That's why he went to jail twice. Mm -hmm. And I don't know why and how he did not go to jail the third time. But they on him. They on him. <laughs> yep. They on him. He called, he's so stupid. He called DCF and said that I was abusing my children. Mm hmm. Wow. Yep. So let me ask you this, Jerry. Did you ever get a chance to speak with your adopted daughter that went back or you haven't spoke with her yet? I spoke to her. She tell me certain things that I cannot reveal here. Okay. But uh, that's a nice surprise for him. Oh. Because he thought, yeah, he thought by going in there. Uh -huh, mm. He thought by going in there oh saying that God. I mistreat my children. Okay. That was going to get them to take the children away from me or remove the kid, put them back somewhere. I don't know where he think. So because let me so ask many you times. this, Jerry. So what we were suspecting, that's... It's oh true. Wow. God. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Wow. Confirm. Confirm. Yeah, he's a, wow. he's a pile of shit. Yeah. And he's that telling me that he's gonna, oh. oh, I'm going to get back at you. You said that I molest my daughter. I say, uh, yeah, why did your wife have a restraining order against you again? So, oh, wow, stay away oh. from me. I don't want yeah, this thing. Got thick, uh, oh, my god, mm -hmm. oh, no, it's getting bigger and bigger. And you know, that's oh, why man. you know, because Chola was telling us that he would so mention his big daughter big is sexy. Uh -huh. You know what? This is a lie because I got to stay on this one. So, oh. mm -hmm. you got details. Mm hmm. Yep. Oh my I can't say much God. about it, but you know, he thought he was gonna do something to me. I called his mom. I said, Listen, I'm gonna tell you bluntly. He called DCF on me. Yeah, they did come to my house what? and talk to all my children, but guess what? They're going after him because he's the one that called. First off, you cannot call with a false information. Exactly. You best federal. Okay, that's mm. how stupid he is. That's how dumb he is. And he thinks he's so smart. Oh, he's going to sue me. He's going to take everything that I have. He's going to go to court. He's going to do this. He's gonna do... Oh, my lawyer going to call you. What lawyer? Okay, I got you mean your, your bug body Jerry. from under the bridge? <laughs> I got you mean your question. body from under the bridge? That's who's going to help you. Lord have mercy. I got one more what question, lawyer? sis. So in regards to that particular situation, is that in motion too as well? Yes, ma'am. Oh yes, ma'am. He wants to say that I did this and I did that. That's that. Sick you guys want to know why you don't see him? Oh Too much truth oh, is wow. coming out here. Yeah. You know what? Oh. Like my grandmother used to say, 
if your head is up, you're going to spit. It's going to come right down to your nose. Put your uh -huh. head down when you're going to respect people. You don't say things that you don't know about. I think he didn't bid off more than he could chew fucking with you. This gonna be your That's what it's been like. Now, now Jerry, did you mind ask if I ask uh when is the uh child due or you can't speak about that? No, I can't. I can't. I can't speak about that. Oh my god, what? I'm about you to can't, y'all. And and when I was in Florida, I was around, she can't speak about it, which is why I didn't bring it to Beagle, but thing. she she can't yeah. talk about it, so I couldn't. I couldn't okay, tell. So I couldn't yeah, tell me first lady much. Y'all, let's go to it. Yeah, I couldn't yeah. tell her much about it either. I can't handle that. Mm. Yeah. Oh. Death. Definitely, because yeah. I was there and I heard it. So definitely. Together for a minute. I'll mm -hmm. be right back. Yeah, but he and he going around yeah. this app talking shit about people, but he the main motherfucker. He yes, was the he number is. one pedophile in, in in Beagle. Yes, he is. My yep. God. But did y'all tell me? I said this, the... I said that about his daughter. I said this, I said that. Let me tell you something. There isn't no smoke without fire. If the smoke that... comes out, there's fire behind it. So you don't want that crying wolf. It's on you. Ooh. You know, go ahead and keep talking and talking and talking. You are not a good person. Jin birth a lot. You're a jerk. You're not a nice Ooh. person. Mm. Yeah, we got to move it. Do you hear? Do y'all hear this? I'm trying to yeah, process. Yeah, I hear this shit. Mm -hmm. This. Shit. I'm trying oh. to process. Y'all hear this shit? Mm -hmm. I, oh, he's gonna sue me for definition of character. This that really spell that. Oh yeah, he, he, he said he's gonna know. sue uh, Devon, me, you, First Lady. Um, uh -huh. yeah, did, yeah. Keep suing. Did, did he ever? Yeah. Did he ever file? Oh, okay. He has so much money. He has such a good lawyer. He's going to sue everybody. He, he should have sued me when I was in Florida with his landlord. He should have sued me then. Uh -huh. Right? Why he he should get a fucking yeah. That is... You know so... what? You know what? We should have ride and see him. That's what we should have done. <laughs> That's exactly <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. This is thick, y'all. I'm Did disturbed. I'm just... this information. Yeah, like that was that was a lot. That was a lot. He got a lot going on. Cannot believe so it. his eviction he, is like the last of his least. Uh huh. Of his he think I'm his problem. I'm not his problem. And yeah, he, he got so a lot. Much, he always things. sticking his food in his mouth. He always say more than he should say. That's his problem. He says a lot, and then he blame everybody around him for it. No one mm. is to blame, honey. It's you. Oh, no one I is wonder. to blame. I wonder how his day one's gonna feel now. And mm -hmm. and and you know they're gonna question his kids. It's a reason why his daughter won't get in the car and drive ten minutes to go see him, and she's driving and yeah. has a whole car. It's a reason. It's for the that. reason why we haven't seen it's a reason children that. around him. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sammy, hey, send me some of that wine, girl, because this tea ain't working. Yeah, I need some of that myself because this is a lot. <laughs> this is yeah. Like, yeah, white mm -hmm. because uh, and I sent you. Yeah, I'm sorry you had to go through that, but I know you're starting to see the light at the end of the tunnel because this is a lie. Oh, yeah, and oh, yeah, you are definitely the least of his worries. This, the, the universe is gonna get the rest of that because that right thank there, you. That, thank you. Oh, he doesn't believe in karma. Oh, yeah, karma gonna get you. He doesn't believe in, <laughs> yeah, he about to get the lesson. He's an old mm. person, you should see him rejoicing. Oh, I will not leave you for free if they give it to me. And one second he said that, next second, oh, I'm not leaving. Oh, when they evict me, I'm just going to go to another house. Really? Okay. They evict him from the front, he's going to go to the back. He's no. From the back, he's gonna, he thinks that's he what gonna he's going to gonna do. Bounce from house to house. Yeah. If, they, if he go anywhere on your property, they're going to lock him up. Them sheriff ain't going to play with him. Hope he ain't does. Play that game. I hope he does. You I just gotta make sure. A glass of wine and then yeah, some he ain't he ain't nowhere in there, Jerry, because he had tried to stay for thirty days and claim rights. You gotta make sure that you got your mm -hmm. all your property secure when he out of there. The front, oh no, the back, let's the side. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you something. I don't even have to get it secured. This first time that they kick him out, the sheriff escort him out. He's never in his lifetime is to put food on that property again. Right. Mm -hmm. He wants to come back. I love mm -hmm. it. I wish he does. I wish he comes back. I wish he comes back. Yeah. 
And you probably should uh, install cameras outside the property she all don't around. Have to do, mm -hmm. try to come. She don't have to do none of that. Long as she have that 24 hour vacate mm -hmm. a premises notice. He come back up and in there if he wants to. you see him on your property, you can call the police and show them. Yep. Yep. They're not going to play with him. Yep. Yep. How somebody can be so evil? All I did was trying to help this guy. After I knew that he was like all that bad. They threw him out of the last place that he was because of the boat. He moved into my property with that boat. Asked me if he can put the boat there. I told him, no, put it outside because I have people working in the house. He put it outside. Two days later, I come. He had the boat in the yard. I said, I told you to leave the boat outside. Oh, he doesn't want them to steal it because he doesn't have a time. First off, it doesn't even work. Who's going to steal that pile of junk? Which is still in my yard. Okay. And let me later. tell y'all. Why he, why he think he running this woman through the ringer? Let me tell y'all something else that happened when I was in Florida. Jerry went and signed. Jerry just bought a whole nother house on cool ass. A whole nother crib sure that mm -hmm. she finna rent out. This is facts. Mm -hmm. So why he think he harming her? The universe is blessing mm -hmm. her. Mm -hmm. sure. Yes, ma'am. Absolutely. Absolutely. Cute little cottage. Beautiful. Beautiful. Way better than that. Mm -hmm. The first one that I have. Yeah. Way better. The only thing, the other one is bigger. But this one is so beautiful. I have nothing to do. I have no work to do. AC, everything worked perfectly. I wasn't there working today. That's what's up, sis. Congratulations. Thank you. Yes, congratulations. Thank you. So, yeah. when he found out, when he saw the 24-hour vacay, did he say <laughs> anything to you or he just... Mm -mm. I was walking in the yard and I saw him snatch it off the door. I look at him, I just walk over. I didn't say anything. Damn. Because he did not expect that. I don't think he even saw me. He's going to hear it now that I saw him. The sheriff put it on the door, walk around the premises, look at everything that was there because they know he was going to steal stuff. Walk around, look at the place, and he went and he saw it. He put his hand in his chin like that and he snatched it off the door. And I saw him, I was like, ooh. I just walk away. I'm like, Jesus, I should have taped that. You know? <laughs> Text me this wow. morning, yelling at me, telling me, don't touch his property, which is my motorcycle, that he destroyed, taking all the pieces out of it. And he think he's going to get away with all that. I got news for him. He think he's going to assume. So, me. do you think your property is safe overnight? That's why I said she fine. should get because cameras you know when he leaves. It will be fine. It will be fine. One of the tenants have not said shit about him. Everybody have said bad things about him. How old boy he is. He has bring uh, a girl in there that's a dyke. And I saw the girl. The girl's like, I can't stand this stupid idiot. He take my money and then have the light cut off. And I can't even take a shower. And this all the girl was doing was complaining, complaining how nasty he was. And then I told the girl, you're going to pay him? The girl said, no, my rent is due the third. I'm not giving him any money. Yeah. Yeah. So everybody that he has put in there thinking that was his friend and he was going to hurt me with those people, they all turned against him. You should have seen how many times they this close to kick his ass. All he, all he does is call the police, call the police, call the police, call. That's all he does because he's afraid someone's going to kick his ass. And even people around the neighborhood tell me, I don't know how they haven't killed him in this place because he treats these people so badly. He has done so much to them. They always Damn. in his face. They... Mm. Oh, I didn't tell you guys how my brother went in there and kicked him in the ass. He was sleeping. My brother walked into the room to the efficiency and kicked him in the ass. I said, oh, fuck up. I'm not paying for you to sleep here. He goes like, oh, I'm recording you. My, my, my brother said, I don't give a shit and took the pillow off for mother head. He said, and my brother said, that pillow is my, that bed is my, get the fuck out. <laughs> he got so scared. He goes, wow. I'm recording you, I'm recording you. Mm -hmm. He goes, keep recording, everybody can record. <laughs> my brother said, I kick him so hard in his ass, I'm sure my toes went in there. He got up wow. like a little dog. <laughs> he, got he got up like a little dog, you know? You should have seen how that guy was in his face last night too. All this thing, all this talk you see him doing, that's all he does, talk. That's all he does, talk. He ain't gonna do shit. Mm -hmm. Not for nothing. It's not gonna do shit. He talks. He has a big mouth. Yeah. I'm recording you. I'm recording you. <laughs> That's mm -hmm. it. There you go. I'm recording you. I'm recording mm -hmm. you. And he tried that with the police. The police said, "Back the hell off my face." 
And the, the police goes, I'm not afraid of going to TGK tonight. Back the fuck up. Okay, 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 officer, okay. Like a little boy. He's recording everybody. Oh my God, the cop that went there last so night. So let me ask you this. Since mm -hmm. he got the 24 hour notice, have he had his mother contact? You? Not yet. He probably hasn't told his mom yet. Not yet. Not yet. I don't know if I'm going to even take that call. Now, mm -hmm. Jerry, the people want to know uh, when the, when he had them four people in the room, were one of them a transvestite? Because we have word that uh, that something strange happened for five dollars and a bag of, of white substance uh, uh, with a transsexual, and uh, it was happening in a car out there in the lot. And, and but I, you know, the people want to know. I, not so much me. Uh, what's going on with that? Was there? <laughs> did you smell a funk when you went in there? Uh, was there like a, a booty funk? Uh, going on there, so, some kind of action of, of, of home you got to say booty juice, Munchie. <laughs> the booty booty oh, juice. Right. You have to double mask, booty juice, double mask. Don't go Ooh. in there by yourself. Wow, Put double wow. mask. That looks strange. <laughs> and then he's telling, he's tell, he's telling people, oh, the house need work. The house is that was that. You don't want that. You're gonna put concrete in my plumbing, and that went to court too, by the way. Yes, mm. ma'am. I went to court too, saying that he's gonna be put um concrete in my plumbing. Now let me see you do it. Let me see you do it because it's already foul in court. Go ahead and do it. Yeah, all he does is talk and talk. He can't do anything. He does the talk, but he can't walk the walk. Talks and talks and talks and talks. And his mom swear that oh he's not doing drugs. He's not doing drugs. I don't know why he does is his money. Really? Are you stupid, lady? What do you think? What do you think people do? That doesn't do drugs and that just just go through he money got like that. That woman so cute, food. She has no idea. She has no idea. And this, even even the fact that he sent that nasty text to his mom telling him he was gonna kill himself, and the same to his sister, and he tried to do the same to me. I don't think he even apologized to his mom because the next day it, the mom was happy that he was still alive. The mom was, I mean, shoot, something like that. You should. Oh. I will be so relieved. Wait, I, I wish you did. You know his mother is sick. Why mm -hmm. would he do that? He evil. He already be robbing her. He's for evil. Money. He's cruel. -ass. He's on drugs. He's on everything. Who knows why people do That's stupid things? I up. have the text blue evil. He texted me too. He texted a few people. Oh blue yeah. Evil, yeah. Did, he text yeah. did he text you too? Look at that. Yeah, we seen that. that Look that. at that. Mm -hmm. Wow. So people can watch. You're sorry for him? Yeah, he texted a lot the of people. Person from Migo too. For his mom. Yes, he did. He had a lot of people up on WhatsApp. He He's had so famous dumb. up too. The I only person I blocked from off. his mom. I blocked him so he can't reach me. Mm -mm. I refuse to block him. I want to know everything that's going on. And that stupid idiot keep texting me and calling me. Well, Jerry, yep. at least you're not going to have to uh, uh, clean up any more uh, uh, Coke cigarettes uh, from around yep. your compound, you know, mm -hmm. and, and mm -hmm. John, you can actually uh, enjoy the scent uh, in, in the area instead of having, uh, you know, the big belly skeezer uh, with his fumes. Uh, he has booty fumes. Oh, I got to use that one, big belly skeezer. His booty pheromone. <laughs> yeah, that's what we call him, big belly skeezer. <laughs> Booty juice. <laughs> yeah. Not bitty juice, bitty yeah, juice. Booty, booty pheromones. <laughs> oh. What a nasty mm -hmm. man. What a nasty man. How can you be hated by so many? I just in my mouth. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> so I want to ask Be hated by so many. Unbelievable. Where did Unbelievable. he get that? Where did he get that damn die from when he died his beard? Who knows? At the dollar store, they have a dollar store by the house. They sell stupid thing like that. It's a spray. <laughs> really, I, I, that is big. I've also gotten word that he goes to this dollar store and he steals little dollar items. Uh, because, That's you know, so he's stupid. He stole money the before and he had no other uh, uh, means of, of, of picking up. But he doesn't get deodorant. He just wants to get little crap like, like uh, I junk food. Doubt it. I will not doubt it. I wouldn't doubt it. Do y'all know he had, the nerve, he had the nerve to accuse 
Jerry of stealing his food stamp card. What? What the? Yeah. First off, why are you on yeah. food stamp, stupid? Jerry, you pay get a job? Jerry, you know? paper up, divine. You hear me? Paper up. Exactly. Remember, she bought them. The he don't need his motherfucking food. Food, food with <laughs> money. Why would she need to take this guy. card? You know how many times he called me? Okay, 11, 12 o'clock. Oh, Jerry, I haven't eaten anything. You have any food in your house? I'm like, yeah, come through. Give him some food. Oh, um, can you cash up me 20 bucks because I haven't eaten anything all day? Send it to him. His mom knows that because his mom called me to tell me thank you because he tell his mom that how many times mm. that I fed him. He told his mom and his mom called me to tell me thank you. And now I still do a food stamp card. Do you really have a food stamp card? First off, why would you have a food stamp card? Don't they only give food stamp to like elderly and Children? And mothers, Why right? He, he can get you it, you know. So, That's you mean he he's crazy? He's probably like a little he's hundred swiping, dollars. Some he's swiping EBT mm -hmm. on any block. This is what's going on out here. I, you uh -huh. know, uh, I will put this in the notes for the beat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Crying for it uh, for food stamp card. Unbelievable. This guy is out of this world. You should have seen him yesterday, screaming, talking to one of my karate instructors, saying that, oh, you are a friend. She's going to screw you over sooner or later. Little he knows, I know this guy since I was a kid. <laughs> I know this guy for so long. And here he is, know me for one year, talking bad about me. And the guy's just looking at me, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. No, you deal with her. She's going to screw you over sooner or later. Well, this was my dream. Well, she shit on it. Motherfucker, why are you having your dream in my house? Go have your dream somewhere else. Uh, back right. He want to have you his know? dream in your house. Wait, how is he having a dream in your property? Exactly. Somebody, it's his property. Mm -mm. Find somewhere else and have your dream. My That's dream should be my stuff. Us. Let me tell you what he told me. This motherfucker told us he paid three hundred to four thousand dollars for those Chinese little fish to put in the pan. Man, he was on here lying his ass. Also. Yes, Try, remember he was telling us he spent all that money on the yeah. fish. <clears throat> he sure did. He's so stupid. In that pond, that pond that you put in Jerry, how much he said he paid Divine seventy five hundred for that? Yeah, thirteen hundred or something. Thirteen thousand or some shit. Now, nah, Jerry, <laughs> <laughs> I can't. <laughs> do it, do it, say it. <laughs> Jerry, so you put the pond in yourself, your blood, sweat, tears. Put I the dug in. the pond up by myself. And some of those rocks were so big, I had to tie uh, a belt around them and tie them in the back of the, my pickup and drag them out. Y'all know I she ain't water. lying. That's too detailed. That's too detailed. Too de yeah. Detail. Yeah. yeah. So he's and not, some of those, so he's some not, of those he hasn't rock, been maintenance I, your property at all. He doesn't, let there. me tell you something. If he sits in this corner of the table and eat, everything that he's finished eating, was, that plate will sit there with whatever's left over on that plate for weeks, months, until I go over there and clean it up. I swear on my life. Ooh. This man does Are you not serious? I swear in my life. Okay? This guy will sit here and eat, and then that food, whatever's left on the plate, will sit there with the plate. You know how many times I go there? When I first started doing the hostel, I had so many plates that someone gave me. I put so many plates there so the people can find place to eat. Every time I go there, I throw one in the garbage. I'll do two of them in because every time he eats, he leave it on the table. I just throw it over with the food. Because who's gonna wash that? Who's gonna now, wash that? Now, Jerry, now you. I'm trying to see exactly how the, the condition of these plates was. It like stuck on food, or was it mold, or was it was it was it maggots? What were you dealing with when you seen these these plates that he would oh. leave around? All of it. It depends how many, how long I felt like looking at it until I tell him, would you pick up your fucking plate? I'm not your maid. I'm not your mother. And after I tell him five, six, seven, ten times, I just throw it away. Because he, he, this is what, oh, leave it there. I'll, I'll take care of it. Leave it there. I'll take care of it. Or I'll grab it. He'll grab it for me and then hold it in his hand. And then when I turn on, he put it back down the same spot. 
He will not do anything. Someone like that won't wash the crack of their ass. If you're going to eat on a plate, you cannot wash it as an adult. You don't bathe. You don't brush your teeth. He's freaking disgusting. That's nasty. He doesn't do anything. You should have seen. Yesterday, I went there with the, with, um, the, you know, the black belt, the karate guys. And he went in there. I said, look at this. Look, look at that bathroom. That toilet. He has not scrubbed it one. The guy said, oh, my God. When he gets out, you need to scoop that toilet, take it off, and throw it in the garbage. Don't even try to clean it and put something else there because you need a suit to clean that. Because it's, and it's, a, it's a rat pack on top of being nasty and dirty. Can you imagine someone that's a rat pack and not even showering? Oh, my. So, so can you tell us the items that he has stored in the shower? He stole his clothes. He stole motor from his boat, little portable motors. He stole a battery. He stole his shoes in there. And by the way, one of the tenants gave him all those shoes because he won't buy one for himself. And they're too small for him. He still wear them. Okay. Wow. He stole, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Do y'all hear this? Pinky. He wearing two little shoes. Pinky just busting out the shoes. <laughs> when, I first, when I first made when I first did the little efficiency that it jump up and stand there, I put a comforter up now. I put a fitted blue with line on it on the bed. And I put a sheet and then a comforter. That was how long ago? Last year. That's still on the bed. And he's still sleeping on it. He has not washed it. Oh, him and Ty, and sisters and brothers. Tell me something. If I could, I'll just bomb that little house. It's disgusting no, that I don't even... No him and Ty yeah. get along. Shit, they using the same oh. sheets for a whole year. They is a perfect mm -hmm. combination. There you go. There you go. There you so go. So you're telling me that, that, that if you lift the sheets up, it looks like two sheets of drywall. It just stands up on its own. That it's thing. not for me. Uh Ugh. The condition of these sheets. Now, uh, um, mm -hmm. I think you should take that bed outside and burn it. You don't want any kind of training Absolutely. DNA on it that's on there Absolutely. left over. That's going to the dump. Absolutely. Okay. I don't even think I want to pick it up. Mm -mm. Okay, for the ones that just everything came in, in there. For the ones that just came in, Big Belly Skeezer was officially served a 24-hour vacate the premises notice as of today. So tomorrow, he will be escorted out by the bailiffs. And yes, Jerry will be there to record it. And um, a host of other things have taken place. Um, he will be held accountable for the one situation. I can't go into details about that, but yes, that's in the makings too, in regards to the babies. But yeah, he he getting handled. Mm -hmm. yes, He's a sick pedophile. I'll say it. We can say less. Say it again. Yeah. He's a sick pedophile. Only because you asked me to say it again, Jerry. I said it again. I, I hear that. Again. And then he's acting like, oh, you go and say that I did this, I did that. I said, there's no smoke without fire, honey. It happened because yeah, you that's started. disturbing. That's very disturbing. So you telling mm -hmm. me after all this that went on, he still haven't humbled himself? Oh, no. He told me yesterday he was going to sue me. He was going to get everything that I have. You know what else he said? I got nothing to lose. You got everything to lose. I'm looking at him. I'm like, that is what a loser said. Is that That's sad or what? Very. Oh, I got nothing to lose. You have everything to lose. I'm looking at him like, yeah, that's all the loser. Jerry, too right many, here. too many help. innocent kids need you. The universe ain't gonna let that happen. You help too many people. Ain't no way. Mm -mm. Yeah. Amen to that. Amen to that. Yeah. I'm telling you, I went over there. We have stray cat that goes over there and have babies. And my and the promise because it's a big place and there's a lot of people eating. They drop little food in here and there, so that's the second litter that cat have had. And one of the little kitty came to me yesterday, and I go to pet the kitty. Don't touch my cat. I'm like, excuse me. Do you think it's bugs in there? Do you He's think what? it's bugs? 
bugs. Like probably, I'm sure. Come on, if you don't shower, oh. Then you better be. That's probably why he shaved his head because he probably couldn't do it with the hair. I think you need to get somebody to clean that up, Jerry. I don't think you need to touch that stuff. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Even if I dump a bottle of clocks all over the place. First off, first what I'm gonna do is put a bunch of little bombs from the from Home Depot in there. And then after that, I'm gonna pay somebody. I don't care how much it costs. Please clean that up, take the bed out, take everything out, everything goes to the trash and hose down that place. Wow. I've never seen in my life someone so nasty and dirty. Mm -mm. Mm. So you telling me this cocksucker walking around with two little shoes on? Mm -hmm. Nigga yes. looking like yeah. twinkle toes. Yes, she said. Now, Jerry, we want to know that these shoes are. Uh, do they have stretch marks? Are uh, is he trying to squeeze his big fat belly skis of feet in there um, to make them fit? And they looking ridiculous, or uh, exactly what's going on here? Are they? Is he able to tie them, or does he just take the laces out and just put his feet in there and and use them as slippers? Uh, this is for the people. The people want to know um, what's going on. He put them on and then he leave the lace open. And sometimes I'm like, why are you wearing shoes? Why are you wearing socks with the shoes that you're walking on the back of the shoes? Oh, that my looks stupid. God. <laughs> I can't even. I can't, you can't make this shit up. <laughs> picture that. Picture that. You I was actually picturing it, Jerry. <laughs> you know? Why so you I my big ass that feet you walking? <laughs> That's terrible. So and with his little red, red Do he own so Jerry made me spit water all deodorant. on my daughter. <laughs> what happened? I'm saying, do he own soap, toothpaste, deodorant? You know. I don't see anything in there, but you know what I see him doing, though? I saw him before. Damn it, it one of the guys good, like shaving you know the you know the shaving um thing the the the, the shaving thing he was taking it and the he was his yeah i said why are you using that isn't that somebody else's oh yeah i use it i said that's nasty you can't use someone else's shaving thing they're shaving their head if they have lice or they have anything you're gonna get it i swear in my life i went in he was using so wait 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 he was using somebody else's razor. Yes, the 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 electric My one. So I thing. went and bought. I went. I swear to God, I went and I bought him one. He can attest to that. He cannot lie about that. I went and I bought him one. Couple of days later, I saw him again with using. He, he's like shaking it. I say, "What are you doing? This is burning." He's like, "Yeah, so and so use it." I say, "That's because you're using theirs. That's nasty. This is not something you share with someone." He will go in their room, take their deodorant, put it on. I've seen him. Okay? And I'm not talking about spray deodorant. I'm talking yeah. about deodorant, roll on kind of thing. Yes. Oh, my God. He'll Did put it know? under his arm. This shit don't work. I don't know what he does. <laughs> I don't even share the He stole with these people's food. Now, this is a lot. <laughs> yes. I don't even share razors he stole with my food. teenage daughter. You hear me, Jerry? I'm a girl. I wouldn't. He's horrible. Horrible. This nigga is a bum. So wait. This is getting on. sad. Are we so picking on a homeless do? person, y'all? I mean, this is this is getting. He'll be homeless tomorrow. He, wait, wait, wait. I'm fucked up right now. So he went in the man's room, took the man's deodorant. And just gonna roll it under his. Do y'all hear this shit? Disgusting. I'm about to choke. Wait, let me process this. So I'm gonna get up. I'm gonna go next door into the woman's house in the bathroom. Get her deodorant. Put some on. Come back out and come in my house. Where did he do this shit at? The savagery was real divine. And then he over there sharing razors, trying to get staff with cactus or some kind of. Oh, uh, no, I gotta get. I have to get Jerry back up here on this. So wait, hold on. I'm back. Did the girl you divine? The, 
did the girl that slept with him on Bigo has she been tested? Do you know, or can we talk? We gotta talk about that on the back end. What? Somebody but actually slept with him. Why? So wait, what <laughs> happened? Is it something we need to know about? Uh oh, uh -oh. No, why would someone sleep with thick, him? Hold on. Uh oh. Wait, <laughs> hold on. Let me brace myself. Hold on. Wait, hold on. Let me pull this shit around here so I can brace myself. This now. You say it. The female that slept with him on here, is it something we need to know? I mean, with all this, I mean, if he's sharing razors, fucking trannies at the gas station for five dollars, he don't take a bath, he living with bugs, and he's skeeting them motherfuckers all over Vigo, they need to get tested. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is a lot. This is a motherfucking lot. <laughs> so Oh, hold on. Have you seen like any bumps and rashes and things on him, um, Jerry? On his on his face, I've seen bumps. Oh wow, we have okay. to. Oh no, this mm -hmm. what I want to We have to. Hold on. This what I want to mm -hmm. talk. Hold on. Uh -uh. I want to talk to Jerry about mm -hmm. this. Jerry, do you remember when his lip was real big and it was running with that green pus? Do you know what that is? Herpes. That's herpes. Oh. That's herpes. Mm. Oh, if I anybody, I'm not. Oh, Natty, you been tested? Okay, so because. You know what I'm talking about, right? When that lip mm -hmm. was real big. And mm -hmm. all I remember that. Can... Somebody has a mm -hmm. photo evidence. I don't know who it is. Uh, it's around. You got to know. You got to know what I'm talking about. His lip was real big and he had all his green pus running out of it. I remember. I remember. Mom. Jesus. Look, look here. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I got to pour some more of this. <laughs> it must have been. It must have been, hey. it, it been a reaction to the cranny booty juice. Now, let me tell oh, you God. what he told me, Jerry. He <laughs> said. <laughs> We got bit by a spider. spider. Hold on. Now, if he got bit by a spider, the mark would be on the outside, not the inside. It was leaking from the inside. Oh. Ooh. So you do remember when that lip was fat. Ooh. <laughs> Y'all remember that since because we was making fun of his ass. Yes. Because he couldn't he talk. He couldn't even he talk. He would get mad. He's like, I can't talk. I he can't got talk. got that nasty woman disease. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Let me get Jerry back up here. Listen, this Linda. So good. Listen, <laughs> Linda. Listen, Let me tell Linda. you. There is two things that give you pus in your lips. If you eat, you don't wash your mouth, and you go to sleep with it, and roaches goes and eat the rest of the food, and the, the, roaches, the roaches, the big roaches, the legs as like little tentacles that goes through your lips and then they will create the bump and then you'll be infected and you'll have pus. Or if you have herpes. Spider bite you does not give you pus. Those are two nasty things that can happen. Corey, is you here, girl? So, so uh, I'm trying to I'm trying to find out, is it like a Joe's apartment type of deal going on there? Is he like sharing pizza? Uh, with the roaches and and and, and the critters that are there, are they having a uh, 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 you know roundtable coke sessions uh, and getting very excited? I don't know. Maybe he's having intercourse with the with the roaches as well because you know it, it that anything else is good for him. So I wouldn't imagine that a roach would be uh, passes what he likes. I'm just I'm speaking for the people. This is not me. He called us and he asked us what could he do munchie to get the pus out of his lip that lip uh, was big mm -hmm. as hell and <laughs> inside was like a little hole where pus was just running and oozing out i am not lying jerry would you tell him this shit is yes serious? i saw that i, I remember that it. sis and mm -hmm. it was I'm green pus just divine. running out divine we have upgraded 
the drink, honey. We are we are sipping this now, yeah. okay? Send me this some. Okay. Yeah, send me some, please. Oh. Give me about three, four shots of that because no, this is real talk. They think I'm lying about this shit. This is the honest God truth. This no, really Jerry, no, Nikki ain't lying. Thank you, Reed. Thank you, love. Thank you. That was so nice. No, Jerry said that y'all divine ain't lying. Divine is not lying. His That's not a lie because I've seen it. Huge, and in the inside, it was like a hole because it was so big he couldn't control it. And you can see oh. the little hole in the lip in the inside. And it was just <laughs> green pus running, just running. Oh. And I told him oh. to make sure he don't swallow it. He said he was I'm gonna sure. go and he was gonna push all the pus out of there. And I said, yeah, try that. Um, then he asked me, was there anything over the counter that he can do for it? I said, to stop it from hurting. I said, I don't know. I said, maybe you have an allergic reaction to some, try some Benadryl. And he got on his scooter. He went to the gas station. He called. He said, um, you said, what was the name of it? I said, Benadryl. He took mm -hmm. the Benadryl. It didn't stop leaking. Like this lip was leaking. He told me when he woke up, it was like all over the little thingy. So you telling Ugh. me he's still laying on these sheets from where his lip was leaking his pus? Yes, ma'am. Same sheets. Oh, oh, shit is that? Oh, no man. wonder him and Ty, I see why him and Ty love each other. Because there's a mm -hmm. woman on here that fucks with him and she have her sheets on her bed for like a year. So I see what they have going on. There we go. Booty she juice mixed with mouth juice. Walking. She also has drywall uh, pizza, uh, Jerry. Nasty, nasty. You don't want to see that. He lied to me. Oh. He lied to me, oh. Jerry, and told me he went to the hospital and they gave him antibiotics for his lip. Hmm. Listen, Linda. But, no, I don't. That was no, the super bum bum. How in the fuck you have all these fluids and juices and all kind of shit on the bed for almost a fucking... I don't even want That's to what happened when yeah. you nasty. Bum, bum. That's what happened when you nasty. Ugh. It's not that hard um, to take care of yourself. To those who Some can't get something right soap. there, I got you. Cheers. I'll take Enjoy that. Enjoy <laughs> that. So wait, let, let's get back into this. So when you asked him about his lip, Jerry, what did he say? Wait, let me get all the way to my feet. I told him there was no spider bite. He did ask me if I thought it was. Wow. Oh, he told you it was a spider bite too, because that's what he told me. Can't no spider bite you in the inside of your lip. Did you see the hole in the inside? We can't hear you, Jerry. We can't hear you. For some reason, we can't hear you. Ooh, uh, we, this shit, they got See? Yeah, listen, listen, Linda. I don't know, y'all. Let me get Jerry back up here because we're going to get to we the need more. Shit. We need more of this tea. Um, this tea is I'm going to need you to put your lips on that straw and, and get a pull for <laughs> me right now. I need it. Thank okay, you. So, so Jerry, listen to me, sis. Listen. Did you see the hole that I was talking about? Because he had yes. a with pulling it. Now, if a spider bites you, it will bite you on the outside, the dry part. Why will the spider had, be inside your mouth? Right. It was a what hole. Why will the spider be inside your mouth? It was a hole that looked like it was kind of whitish around it. <laughs> And then it was like green pus leak. Okay, so you saw what I saw. Like this big. I'm like, what's going on? That yeah. lip was big as fuck. It was so big, he could barely talk. It was so filled with pus. And the pus, uh -huh. he couldn't control it. It was just run. Like if he was to pull it down to show it to you, you'll see like the white area around the hole. And pus would just be oozing out of it. I was like, oh my God, yeah. What a subhuman. It's so disgusting. Oh. This guy. Mm. 
No, Somebody this like is that. Real, this is real shit. This real shit. But listen, he has a friend on here, and she traded on her whole family for him. But she lives sort of like him. She had these sheets on her bed for like a whole year. Uh, there you go. And we still ain't got go. her, what her baby daddy said about her. We're going to get into that too a little later. Yeah, some so, other time. And you know what, first lady, no, this, explains, this explains what the baby daddy said about her. Right. He said she she really bad. She really baths. She do like whole baths. She take like a washcloth and go in the bathroom, wash her face, and you know what with the same towel. Mm -hmm. So what's wrong yeah. with taking a shower? No, nah, that's what her baby cool. daddy said. Best friend. Uh, we just we just giving what we heard. <laughs> So this mm -hmm. sounds and we like, got that we've been had that recorded, but we holding yeah. that back because we waiting on something this else. Like a, mm -hmm. So her and him would make a perfect combination. Like she might as well just let it move in. They would spend less money. They only need one sheet per year, um, and they can school yeah. people together. Right, that's right. Right, they can <laughs> scam together. Oh, she's fine. a scammer too. Yep. He could bring he could bring his roaches, and she'll bring her roaches, and they can have baby roaches yeah. together. I he hate y'all. And, and baby bed bugs. You know what else? <laughs> he can go next door, steal a tube of deodorant. They can share it. So mm -hmm. you know, hey. Ooh, they Jack. can make it do what it do. So he sound like one of them type of people that go in the hospital stealing toothpaste and shit. With his Bad mom ass. And sheets and shit. Public restrooms. This motherfucker down in McDonald's stealing the tissue out the bathroom with his bum ass. I would just like to say for the record, we can't hear you, Jerry. Um, cool and Haitian, if you're watching, I've been Hold telling on, over and over again, it was safer for you to just stick to arguing with Troller back and forth, but no! You love this shit. I still oh, can't you. hear you, Jerry. Can you hear me now? Yeah. Yeah, so let me ask you this, Jerry. I know this will be a disgusting moment right now when I'm going to ask yeah. you. Mm -hmm. Can you kind of give us a brief of that smell like as if funk and booty with like must or like, like hot dog water? Hot <laughs> dog water? <laughs> Or earring bags, <laughs> like what? <laughs> it's, like taking an, it's like taking an onion, right? Slice it into mm. half and put it in your old shoes and stick it in the, oh I don't know, in a cobble or something and leave it for a week. So you it's telling booty. me he smell like, wait, so you uh, telling me he smell like onion. he got a, so he smell like he got a vagina. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's scary. Now, maybe, it's scary. Now maybe. We I never, I, hey, listen. Smelling like he had having it could be the same. I don't know if you have one or not. The way he acts, sometimes I'm like, damn. What's on so the So let me ask you this, Jerry. Do we smell like one of them nasty women that be walking around with a yeast infection and a bacterial infection? Oh. Where you got to be like, where you got to be like, wait a minute, hold on. And then he just jumping. So you tell me he just walk up in your face smelling like that? Smelling like almost shit. Dog so ass. Have you ever, a, have you ever, a, have you ever told him about balls? Oh, goodness. Four ones. So wait, <laughs> have you ever told him about his smell like face to face? No, I just walked away a lot of time. Sometimes I put perfume. He's like, oh, can I get some? I'm like, sure, right here. <laughs> Wait, he asked you, you for perfume? Because mm -hmm. I always have car. perfume in my car. So I will spread a car sometime. And he's like, oh, can I get some? I'm like, sure, I'll spread a whole thing on him. Sometimes I give it, I say, you can have it. <laughs> I want to get Ooh, Hold that was funk perfume. Uh, uh, we got to process this. Wait. <laughs> Wait, motherfucking wait. Hold so, on. He asked Hold on. you for female perfume? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He'll wear anything. Uh, you know, right between, right there, he has some kind of corrosion going on and the funk, 
or maybe cheese curd uh, going on in that particular area. Uh, the people want to oh, know. Wait. Let me. Let Let him even get near you, like we can't hear we can't. you, sis. Again, we there can't hear you now. Good. What happened? She froze and she's now she frozen. Okay, you froze up. It's a reception. She I got, think we gonna she need got something better than that, Sammy. We're gonna need some <laughs> real shit. like you know, that powerful <laughs> industrial <laughs> light saw they use in the hospital. <laughs> I got some okay, alcohol, so, so I got Jerry, some lysol, I got let me let, let me ask you this, Jerry. Did you smell a stench when that lip was big like that? Yes. Yes. Oh my God. I'm about to throw up y'all. I'll be right back. Jerry, being Listen. that you are being that you a dentist, how did you feel looking in his mouth at that moment? Tell the people. You go to my office, I'll just brush it off. Ooh. So many times I go, like, oh, yeah, I need a deep cleaning. I need to go to the office. I'm like, Bush, I don't want to go in that mouth. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I, we want to know is is mm -hmm. what color was his tongue like a white or did it have a green residue from the from the pus bump? Uh, uh, you know what is going on with it, and does he have some kind of bumpage going on there on his tongue as well? Uh, you know this is this is an alert. This is a a, a special alert for all. Uh, women out here in America, you know, to stay away from Big Belly Skeezer, uh, because he's this is a very nasty thing. It doesn't matter how much money you need; it is not worth it, lady, because uh, you know you're gonna have a bump bump uh, in an area that you don't want. Uh, and and for you trannies as well, you, uh, don't mess with this man because he's gonna leave all kind of bump bumps, and it's gonna be unappealing <laughs> to uh, whoever you're gonna uh, be with. Uh, and I'm just speaking for the people. This is a crying shame. Mm. Oh, boy. I'm just trying to figure out how do a person dye their hair and their beard and don't wash their ass? That was booty dye, girl. Booty dye. Mm -hmm. it says, yeah. It's new. This is tuna fish, baby. Yeah, we can't hear you again, uh, man. This is a lot. So this is a lot. Woo, this is a um, Miss Mama's in the box above me. Yes, we sir. don't need your ad libs. You ain't helping. I'm trying to drink my drink. <laughs> this is a lot. This is a he lot. talking about that 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 booty perk, girl. You know that that stuff new. That that. <laughs> I'm a, I'm a divine. I'm gonna let Spider up real quick. Okay. You, Neen, your slow ass. Neen, Neen is doing timeout. Can somebody mute her ass in the comments immediately? She don't have the right to talk because I texted her ass uh, at the beginning of this live. So, wait, hold on. I'm gonna hear it. I'm sorry, Jerry. I'm trying to process all this. Um, uh, uh, so wait, when you see the sheets, is it like stuff on it, like spaghetti sauce or whatever on the sheets? And... Oh, we can't hear you again. We can't hear you again. Girl, look, just call us on the phone and sit up there, be pretty, and I just put you on speaker, girl. <laughs> okay, you, this is a whole motherfucking lot right here, y'all. Baby, girl, I, I ain't kicked my ball off the floor word. yet. I want to just ask her a few questions, then I'll let Monkey back up. I wasn't really trying to be up here long. All right, okay. Uh, Jerry, if okay. you could hear me, because I haven't yes, been I here, can. so okay, wait, Spider so my question, you do that. Let me get me a recap, okay? Um, okay, today. Big Belly Skeezer was officially served a 24-hour vacate the premises notice. So tomorrow he will be getting exported off the property and Jerry will be there to videotape that. And as far as the children, the adopted children, that's in motion. He will be getting 
handle that. So go ahead, uh, Spider. Okay. So Jerry, um, so from you know last month, I just wanted to ask you just to be clear. So basically, the reason why he's just now being evicted is because he was what biding his time to try to stay at the property longer, right? Hear you, Jer. I can't hear you, no, babe. Man, keep cutting out. We can't hear you. It might, Jerry. You might need to update your Bego app. That's what I'm thinking. It could be. She might need to update her particular Bego app. Uh -huh. <clears throat> That's that uh the Haitian that's that cool and Haitian trying to do his little voodoo. He mad as hell, y'all. Li li <laughs> listen, Linda. Um, I feel bad for him at this point. Not bad. I feel I take pity upon him because it's really giving scavenger. It's really giving like, you know, one of them kids that probably never had no home training, never had no and I think that's what it was for him. He ain't He's no. just a real scavenger. Really no, cool family has drink. money. Uh -uh. Yeah, send me a I'm not gonna let you do that, swallow. number eight. Go ahead I mean, a spider. Uh uh. Cool comes from a good family. He's just a piece of shit. Okay. His okay. sister is a doctor. For real. No, he's a oh. piece of shit. Because what she's describing is giving like gutter bomb homeless person that yeah. never had no home training. You know what I'm saying? It's mental illness. Jerry His family don't want to deal with him, so they trying to throw him on Jerry. That's what's really going on. They tied his ass too. Jerry, I think you need to upgrade your app on Bego, and I think that's why it's doing that to you. Okay. Can I be heard now? Yeah, yes, we can hear you now. Okay. okay. I just got two or three questions, Jerry. So I was just, I, 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 I knew you was trying to answer that first question about him biding his time. And that's why he was able to stay for the little extra month that he was extra, you know, in the house. He kept, I kept try, trying to reapply, going back to the court and trying to go to court, like, like the judge, he wants the judge to hear him. And the judge just like, they don't want to hear him. They don't want to hear him. And he keeps following different motion, lying and lying and lying. But then all the judge is getting on my end is everybody else's police report how he's bothering everybody in, in the house. So finally, the judge just grant motion to me and <clears throat> didn't even bother listen to what he had to say. Okay, and so then tomorrow, I know that you've been back over to the crib and stuff where he's at. Has he told you anything about <laughs> where he might go? Did he act like he has somewhere else to live? He well, yeah, like actually, it? he said that you said he could move in, Spider, so he was on his way. I'm just pushing it. Girl, Good don't stop making me <laughs> fragile. <laughs> Gary, is he acting like he's not going to go? He yeah. knows he can't come up here. He better wash his stink ass. He come to my motherfucking house. He better he go sleep by town on them green sheets. Kev, he go by town and sleep on them green sheets. Hey. <laughs> Hell no! Just go over your stinky ass and wash his ass early. I got it. Well, I know he's not gonna call me because one, he blocked, and two, he don't trying to get that smoke with Troller because I'm gonna call Troller on the video. I'm like, what you doing? Look. Oh uh, no, he don't want that smoke. He don't want that smoke here. He don't want He'll that smoke. He'll be a missing person around. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to act. Why y'all ain't letting this lady answer my question? Because I really want to know if he's saying he got somewhere to go. Or, I mean, like, you know he perpetrating, but you know. He said he's he probably talking about the back house. Right, you he's been moving to her front house. He said he's not going anywhere. Yes, that's what he said. <laughs> Bitch, shut the fuck up, Big K. He yeah. said that for real, Jerry? Yeah, that's what he said. Jerry, he said, he, hey, Jerry, yeah. he said, I'm not done with you yet. He going to keep on renting from you, huh? Crazy. No, he's not. You're not letting her ask the question. Get her trouble. Right, <laughs> he can't talk about the property. He's right. Okay, this is my last question. I'm going to let my brother back up. Okay, so um, you said that there's the, the other thing is actively open as far as the children go. We're not going to discuss that. Is there any other charges that have been brought up against him? Um, you know, with him and the tenants and some of the illegal things that he's been doing with them? Or is any of that being investigated? 
No, because the female never wanted to come up. I spoke to her twice and trying to tell her she's, she did not want to come up. I guess she's too embarrassed. She didn't want to deal with it. We're going to find a tent somewhere and draw that cam up from the tent. That say that he, don't, he, he, got got one. he got one. He bought one from the guy. He bought one from the guy. And I walk into my property and he had the tent open in the front yard. I'm like, what the hell is this? He's practicing. He and know he where he's going to go to mine. Yeah, he goes, oh, I just purchased it. You like it? I'm like, yeah, he put a mattress inside of it. I'm like, yeah, but why is it in my front yard? So he did tear it up and take it off. So I'm sure right now he got someplace to sleep. Yeah, he going he gonna to put that tent up. He going to come up in a tent. He going to say that he owns all tent city and that he started a tent city and he written out tents. Mm -hmm. and, uh, Girl, I need your phone. And it's gonna be too bad, too silly, gonna believe it. It's gonna be J Max believing it. Aurora. It's gonna be a couple of people like, dang man, he written tense. Y'all better leave him alone. He's an entrepreneur. Yeah. <laughs> He's smart. That boy is smart. He's gonna put that boat. He's gonna put that boat inside of a tent. <laughs> <laughs> now, I can only imagine a year later what that tent is going to smell like because if he oh, gonna end up a week, uh, it would be ridiculous. And a day later. Also, I wanted to say I'm just putting things together for the people, but uh, if he was on King Knowledge's panel, I mean, Molly told me that King Knowledge likes to get get uh, his dick sucked from the back. I mean, excuse me, I, my vulgar, uh, but yeah, but that's what she said. She said, you guys like to suck King Knowledge from behind, from the back, like so with his booty hole. So maybe that uh, that was appealing to Cooler Haitian and he went over there on King Knowledge's panel. He might have thought that, you know, I mean, I'm just I'm just speaking for the people. I really, I have no real information. I'm just asking questions. And I'll be observing what's going on out here. And I go off of what you gotta realize say. that you're dealing with the same that all of them people you just named are nuts. <laughs> they all liars. Like you, you talking about Molly? Molly's a liar. She's a no liar. Her life is probably just as bad as Cool Age and, and King Knowledge already exposed all his lies. But then you have you, that's all three. Remember this nigga was a y'all forgot he was a professional basketball player when he first came to that. Mm. They own all and the property. Yeah, him and Kulation used yeah. to figure out what insulation's an airplane, right? You know what's crazy? I'm yeah, I'm, he written out I'm airplanes. Say something the first time you said that. So, so here's the thing where he got the plane thing from. Okay? And give me one second. I'll show you where he got the plane thing from. Wait a minute. Let me make my outro face. <laughs> I'm sick of hey, her shit. He told that we were in the airplane. <laughs> Chief finna pull up that news clip where he told that man that he scammed that at, at your age. I, I owned the airplane. I don't know what you complaining for. <laughs> You're broke or something like that. He told them people he scammed. Oh, yeah. He told that Leon Haitian dude that. Now, yeah. now, Terry, he also mentioned that uh, that he be taking trips to uh, England and France and all kinds of parts of the world while everybody's broke. Uh, did you observe him taking any kind of trips out here, or was so it all? This is where he got that plane story from, and you know, motherfuckers okay. love to hate on me on this motherfucker. So let me show you where he got this "I own a plane" shit from. This part. Do you want to know something? You wanna know something? I take plane, I take um airplane lesson. I was learning how to fly. I told him about it. I don't know if that's when he starts saying that shit. And then when he know well, he when he first met me, I used to go, I used to travel the world. I used to travel to um Europe and Paris and Germany and all these places because me and my um I have a friend of mine that used to breed um Bengal cat. So we sell them to people. most people that buy it, these people from Germany, you know, Italy, and I've been all over Europe delivering the cat. I was the delivering cat girl. So I told him about that. Maybe that's where he gets the stuff that he traveled the world. Who knows? He's crazy. Whatever you tell him, he turn it around and make it about him.
Oh, it, you, it must be like those paintings uh, that you had hanged around, and then he was telling everybody that his daughter was this beautiful artist uh, that did all those pictures. But yeah. but they were really store bought paintings that you bought from Bed Bath and Beyond. Uh, uh, <laughs> Performed this is is this correct? From Amazon. Yeah, I bought from Amazon. Look, I got some more at my house. Look over here. You see that? You see the Buddha? It was a big Buddha that I had in my in my in the other house. You see that one? Look at that one. Okay. Let me show you one more. The, the one I bought more. the other one, I bought it. I bought both of them together. And that's the one that he said that because that one is a cloth material. And this is like the one that he said that that was his. That was his daughter that did. See that one, the blue one? And then the one I have over there was a red one with different colors in it. And he keep telling people that his daughter painted it. I'm like, oh great. When they told me that I was almost I was sitting, I almost I was sitting down drinking some water, I spit the water out and I almost fell off the chair. When he Jerry, said that his daughter drew that. Jerry, all I have to say is that, you know, you keep putting your lips all close to the camera like that. You know, this is uh, very appealing to a brother like me. I'm just, I'm just <laughs> observing over here. Uh, you know, you continue doing what you're doing out here. Uh, you're making it uh, uh, a good scene. Uh, uh, let me I'm double just, click your screen next time you do I'm that. I'm just making sure that you know what a real lips look like. Not that fricked up shit that he had in his face with that pus coming out of it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm actually just trying to be the next boy in action. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. We're not going there. Mm -mm. No. Yeah, Mudgy, don't. I mean, uh, Mudgy. Uh, Jerry, don't hire no more landlords or any kind of people to help you out unless you check a background search and you know this person is legitimate Never. with business because that dude right yep. there. He kills it. He kills yeah. it. I don't want to do that. Mm -mm. No. So and now y'all know where the airplane telling. story came from. Yeah. He's telling yeah, all these people son. not to pay me. Yeah. yeah. I respect you for holding in on there, though. Don't <laughs> let that dude ruin your business, man. You still happy, though. That's a good thing after dealing with a whole year of this bullshit. Oh, my That's God. That's some straight bullshit. Yes, it is. We did. We've been dealing with that dude for two years. Wow. I knew he was a liar when I first met him, though. This motherfucker said he's gonna move out the back and move in the front. Move in the front house. Yep. That shit crazy. Yeah, I can. I can honestly, honest to God, I say I've never been fooled by that guy. That's what a fact. Why would you lie to tell people that you own an airplane? That, it's crazy. <laughs> and then why would you own an airplane but wear the same clothes every day? That's exactly what I was saying two years ago. You used to be on, in that other place. You used to sit on the same porch with the same mm -hmm. exact clothes. Like, you had the same clothes on for three days. Who owns an airplane that? that don't change their clothes? Mm -hmm. uh, he, when said he, tell him. he said he got a submarine, too. I bet. <laughs> now, you, you don't own the military. Oh, oh. <laughs> Watch when he come back, he gonna be a secret agent. He really on a, you know, he he's on a mission. He has to live in a tent because the CIA wants him to. What a jerk! And I wouldn't be surprised, Trollo, on that shit. <laughs> you know, when I first met him, I had a Porsche Cayenne. First thing he asked me, "Oh, um, I need to ask you something." I said, "What is?" It? He goes, oh, can I borrow your Porsche so I can go impress a girl tonight? I'm like, are you crazy? Oh, I have a date. Oh, come on. I'm just going to be gone for a couple of hours. I say, again, are you crazy? Why would I give you my car? I barely know you. <laughs> to see the, 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 the way this guy thinks. He's crazy. Why would I give you my car? And what are you going to do when she come around again and he ain't got it? And he's, he's sleeping on a bunk bed with a bunch of strangers. Thank you. <laughs> No, he's going to be sleeping in the airplane. You forgot. <laughs> yeah, they're going to smell the dinginess. Like, first of all, you jump in a Porsche Cayenne. She jump in there with you. She can smell you. As soon as she get in there, she's going to be like, this is a, what kind of. Bullshit is that? That's not your oh, You buy a Porsche, but then buy no soap. 
Yeah. Shit crazy. Cheaper. Jerry, oh, whose red van one. was that that cool had that he was driving around? That was the a red van. That was a pickup truck. That was Jerry's pickup truck. That's my pickup. It's outside. I can show you. Uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, go show it to us. He got blue that evil. You know what? Blue evil, That's one of his. the victims. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna show you guys my car. It's really ain't that bright though. <laughs> it's cheaper to I keep her. Da, 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 da. It's cheaper to keep her. Right? I wanna I wanna this know is, from all the people that was baby. victimized by this guy live. How do they feel now? Like Blue Evil, how do you feel now though? Cause you 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 was going for this for two years straight. This man, you came up in the same okay, shoes, same yeah. clothes, same everything this for two is, years straight and convinced you he was car. a businessman. How do you feel right now, Blue Evil? This is my new car, right? And then this is another car that I have. I have you a BMC. He was trying to make me give him. And I told him, no way. Okay. Right. Is GMC. Can, Can you see it? It's too dark. And this is but it's oh, kind of dark. dark. Okay, hang on a second. I need somebody to come up on the panel for the recording. Anybody, somebody, anybody. Ashley Banks, come yes. up here. Please Ashley don't be scared. 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 Where, where Ashley at? Where Ashley at? <laughs> in the comments, hiding. Oh, I don't see her. There she go, right there. Come up here, okay. Ashley. Oh, Lakia came up here, though. I'm going to hold this seat for one second, Lakia. She, you can get back in the queue, Lakia. I'll get you up. Exerciser. Where you at, Ashley? Hola, que tal? Hey, where the hell is Ashley at? I could have left Lakia up here. Oh, yeah, where you at, Ashley? Ashley's scared of me right now, Shola, because I told her I'm about to come over her house and dot her eyes and cross her T's. Uh, she definitely, she blocked me. <laughs> oh, y'all that made Ashley mad. Oh, okay, come on, Lakia. Uh, she get mad come once a month. Ashley. Come on, Lakia. Lakia. <laughs> it's the shot. It's the shot. You're welcome. This is car number one. I just okay. got that. It's very dark what? in here. It's what the, year? Uh, 2022. What? What model? That's a nice one. Okay, girl. The three, the 350 ML. I know that. Okay. That's I know the that's one right. I just tread. I just tread the Porsche for that. Cause I had the Porsche for five, for six years. And then this is car number two that I'm trying to sell because I, I don't need so many cars. This is a GMC that I have. This is the car that he wanted me to give him. He was crazy about selling him this car. I'm like, how am I going to give you the car? You don't even have any money. Okay, I bought this for the for my foster kids because he has three row seats in it. Then I changed my mind. I wanted the minivan. That's when I bought that red minivan. The red minivan had problem, and I gave it to him. And I have to park the park, the pickup outside because I have no space for it. This is the pickup. It's the Mazda. That's the one you're talking about, right? Yeah. Yeah. Pickup. Yeah. Yeah. That's my pickup. <laughs> that's my pickup. And then really? I have he the. The he said he just bought him a brand new Denali. Yeah, he wish. And I bought this minivan, this Toyota minivan for the girls. For my foster kids. So he still got that minivan that you gave him? Yeah, I gave him the... I bought a Quest and I gave it to him. And then after that, I bought this one, this blue one. Oh, he about to be living in that Nissan. Yeah, everybody. No, I gave it away. I was gonna Are give you... it to him. I was gonna give it to him. I gave it to my to my brother. Yeah. Right now I have four cars. I had five, which I tried to give him one to help him out. Since he was such a jerk, I took it back. I gave it to someone else, and he was about to cry. That's the car that he he removed all the bottom of the car. 
it was a Nissan Quest. It was an F uh, minivan. I didn't like it much. He had a little problem in it, and I gave it to I gave it to him when I realized he was such a jerk. I went to pick up the the minivan, but he already went and took out all the parts underneath of it. He stole the manifold, and he stole all the um um the muffler system that I had just installed in the car. He's such a piece of shit, this guy. I don't know why he would cross you. The situation he in, all this stuff you was giving and doing for him, he crazy. That's my Be point. You know, because when you're a piece of shit and when you're a bad person, no matter what you try to do, it's going to come out. Because you're going to do it for so long until the per people realize the type of person you are. Because you know why? You have screwed, all you have screwed up so many people before. And I'm thinking he's a nice person and I try to help him. And he turned on and starts screwing me. Now he's fucked because now he doesn't have shit. He doesn't even have, have a place to live. Doesn't even have a place to live. Just because you're such a jerk. You know? The thing is, everything that I give him, he calls his mom. His mom even say, oh, is she your girlfriend? Why is she giving you all this stuff? You don't have to be somebody's boyfriend or girlfriend for them to help you out if you're in need. I believe if you have, you can help somebody as a need. You just help them. What's the big deal? You know? Even his mom was telling me that. His sister told, told him the same thing. He's telling me his sister told him that. His mom told me that. I'm like, no. I have my own boyfriend. He's such a nasty person. <laughs> Well, they don't know all the other people that you was helping. They probably only hearing his side. You know what I'm saying? He might probably got it looking like it's yeah, just him. Yeah. Well, people that knows me always uh, keep telling me, you're too nice. That's why that happened. You keep giving to people that's just taking. You have to give to people that give so they can realize what you're doing for them, not people that are just takers. People that are just takers just come and look at you thinking you're stupid. You're just giving all the time. So that's why I I rather do you know the foster thing and I help the children that really in needs that really in needs of food the needs of a place and stuff like that instead of dealing with people like him. such an horrible person i've never seen anybody so i've never seen such a bad person in my life <laughs> well keep helping people the universe gonna keep blessing you that's a fact absolutely well jerry tomorrow we will be celebrating Yes, ma'am. I will be have a celebration. <laughs> I will be feeling Can't wait. Cannot wait. <laughs> We're gonna drop the disco ball tomorrow. Oh no, go! Walk out the door. Don't there we go. Let me ask you this, um, Jerry. Do you think you'll be able to go live while you over there? Or you just I would be, be That would be nice, man. Wow. Yeah, well, so when you get there, we're going to go live on this because this shit right here. <laughs> I can't wait. This bum be ass. <laughs> This is a hot motherfucking embarrassing mess. He ought to be ashamed of himself. Oh, yeah. Wait till I pull all the sticker and all over his boat. I'm just trying to figure out how he's going to get rid of these boats tomorrow. Do you think he did wait on the night? Do you think you can call the tennis to see if he started moving this shit up out of there? Ooh. 
this public don't try to tell the people of the tenant. You gotta understand. If you guys live, if you guys live in Miami, you will know. You find blood on the side of the road all the time. People drive the boat and they don't want to eat anymore, and they can tell it because buying a boat is the. They tell you in Miami the best day about buying a boat is when you sell it. You know, so nice. you find so many boats. I can be driving and I find five boats from here to like driving for twenty minutes. I can find five abandoned boats on the street. He taking those boats. He tried to take one that was by the hostel that I have, and the police told him he couldn't take it, and he tried to get in a fight with the police. Because the boat was abandoned by somebody, and then they find the owner, and they tell the owner they find the owner, and they tell the owner they he has to come and pick up the boat. So he was pissed because he wanted the boat. Because what is dropped close to your property, and nobody claim it, and they cannot find who it belongs to. You can put a lien on it, and after that, they can take the boat. So this motherfucker you know? walking around picking up abandoned boats. It's not you really think he's buying those boats? That jerk has no oh, money. No, I, know he's not bad. Oh. I know he's not bad because he ain't got no motherfucking money. And none so. of them work. Oh wow. None of them work. Ooh. <laughs> he, told me, he told me that he had five huge boats that he was doing Airbnb in, and then they drowned. They this they, that he's such a liar. I don't believe none of that. Well, I'll be about five lost folks. Only thing I can say to Big Belly Skis is you have been fully exposed. Yeah. Mm. I just want to know what's his next storyline. What do y'all think is his next storyline? The tent business. Oh. <laughs> I, I know what his next storyline is going to be. He and now he's back. In. From out of space. Now, I'm going to tell you what his next, <laughs> I'm going to tell y'all what his next storyline is. He won the property. He going to go get some paperwork ordered up, which he can still collect rent. He just can't stay on the property. And yeah, we ready for you, fool. We know what's up. <laughs> You'll pop up with something. Oh, yeah. He going to come up with something. Oh, because he's definitely... Coming back to, to be here and here now. He in the window. Him and that uh that one year sheet of bed bitch, they in here. Him and that cool ass Not try news. Yeah, try news. <laughs> Wait, it's the fact that the sheets been on the bed for a year plus something. They got a lot of shit in time. They have a lot of hey, do you know that? Do you guys know that after he had that bump in his lips, he had an uh -huh. finger also and lost the finger. The finger was all puffy. What? So he kissed. Yeah. So you telling me he ate the poop nanny and put his finger in it? Yeah. Oh, he ate his finger. Probably. <laughs> yeah, one of his fingers was infected. The finger was swollen and the, in the lip, so he ate it and played with it. Wow. And played with it. Yeah. Uh, he was dipping his finger in the pudding pops, in the pudding, in the pudding jar. He, he needed to leave him. Hey. He told somebody in the comments he got hit with a hammer. Y'all hear that? With a hammer. <laughs> that was not a roll of hammer. That was a fake thing. He was like, he lost the nail. And he told me that's because he was biting the nail. So where did the hat get from? Okay. So he got two excuses. He got hit with a hammer. He mm. missed the nail. Mm -hmm. Okay. So which one y'all think? The hammer, herpes, or biting the nails? <laughs> All the way. I'll say herpes You're for 500. Loud, oh, okay. All right, hold on. So, what do y'all think about the swollen finger? Hammer, ingrown fingernail, or herpes? Herpes is very contagious. Oh! 
Child, look here, listen, Linda. Uh -uh. This shit too much, ain't it, Sammy? Yeah, girl, we gonna need another model. This shit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Get that girl. bottle, girl. Get that bottle. Yeah. My, I got a whole full blown migraine right now. Like, oh, I can't. You know what? I'm like a kid on the day before Christmas. I'm going to bed early tonight so I can wake up for tomorrow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yes, I okay. hear that. I'm definitely going to bed early. I'm telling you, I ain't fucking around with these weirdos. I thought I was gonna go ahead and go in on on, on um uh, mushy mushy pussy at the kitchen table, but it's just absolutely no point because it deserves no fucking light because exactly. this is much more goddamn entertaining. <laughs> yeah, this is this is right here. I'm going to be early like the day before Christmas because I can't wait to tomorrow. I can't wait. Okay. I'm going to sleep with the biggest smile in my face the whole night. <laughs> okay. And all I can say is that at least Troller tried to talk him off the ledge. I tried to talk him off the ledge. He told us to kiss his ass because he loves this shit. And, and and oh well, we here now. But he mm -hmm. said, I, "I like to, you know, I'm speaking for the people again." He was on there saying how divine is finished, and mark his word. Within the next month, there won't be a divine, and he's going to make her run off the app, and and all this happened. And then you know what happened? It was like he was looking in the mirror because exactly what he said happened to him. And I'm just trying to understand uh, uh, exactly uh, what will make him think that he can come against the great divine out here. But uh, you know, some people are silly, and I just sit back and laugh uh, as I do. <laughs> you gotta understand Trona ran him off land. I don't know why he brought his ass back. I'm just trying to figure out what the fuck did he come back for? Did he leave something? Did he did you leave something, motherfucker? <laughs> I'm serious. Trona ran him off land. This motherfucker came back. He must have lost something. Child, look here. Ooh. Well, I done burnt my lip with all oh. this hot tea. I just want to say that. Okay. This is a lot, ain't it, Corey, girl? <laughs> girl, I need an ice pack. <laughs> and, and at least it's not as cool as lip. You know, you got a little burn off of the but it's not as bad as it is. Munchie, that's why I say it's about lips. <laughs> <laughs> oh don't do it don't do it like that, Jerry. You wanna oh, call let me lady? Too far? Monkey call that boy <laughs> swamp mouth. <laughs> Hold on, matter of fact, let me open it up. Cause she done, she done already released the beats on this ass, so I can open it up. Hello. Honey. The updates on Big Belly Skin. Hey, lady. Oh, girl. oh Somebody feel hey. lady in. What's up, Charlotte? What was it? In the queue. Get back in the queue. Hey. I just got off work. So I missed it. Dang. Well, they'll recap you. Somebody recap <laughs> <Okay>. you. <love. laughs> well, you can get the recap. Or you can go to Cloud Chasers on Bego and, and see my man. You know, he's going to have this up and it's going to be uh, amazing for people to rewatch and rewatch. Make sure y'all follow, subscribe, and hit the like button as well uh, for my boy Fraser out here because he ain't playing, man. He's doing it in a big way. 
Yeah, I'm already subscribed. I haven't seen it yet. I guess he ain't posted yet. Cause it just nah, we still we still doing it. <laughs> okay, I just I, I guess I just have to wait. Cause I deserve to know this. That motherfucker called my phone, and I ain't give him my phone number. Nah, I want to know what's going on. Well, as of today, Big Belly Skeezer was served by the bailiffs. A 24-hour oh. vacate the premises notice. So, therefore, tomorrow, <laughs> there mm -hmm. will be the lights, camera, motherfucking action on that ass. Oh, yeah. Okay. 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 All right. Well, he got a tent with a bed in it. What? We got justice, justice. Gotta go home. That's what's <laughs> up, G baby. Tell him you ain't gotta go home, but you gotta get the G baby. <laughs> <laughs> what's up, G baby? <laughs> mm -hmm. Wow, man. The house is so much, shall everybody. That's my house, really, really. Your house, okay. Never seen nobody get evicted out their own house. This is some crazy shit. He thought every time I go over there, he called the cop. Did somebody tell me how you get walked off your own premises? <laughs> Only this motherfucker get evicted. I'll throw it on front of it. Yeah, you don't. I wish I had a red top, but I'll throw it in front of him on his way out. <laughs> she said he got evicted on his day off. You know what? I cannot. Wow. How you get evicted well, on you your day you off, Fred? What you should <laughs> ask the bailiffs is if they can make him take his funk with him. <laughs> it's fun that they always recording. I'm recording you. I'm recording you. No, 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 not the phone. The funk. The smell. Smell. Oh, the funk. He got to take the funk. No one want that funk. Mm -mm. He gonna hit. Jerry up and tell her we both Haitians. Um, we can work it out. Ain't shit to work out. What the fuck y'all gonna work out? Another year of non payment of motherfucking rent. Uh huh. Like I'm stupid. It's been done with his funny um uh whatever whatever you call it, lease that he's walking around with saying that I signed it. Signed it. Fake ass funny lease. lease. Mm -hmm. Well, you know um. Maybe Queen Knowledge got a place for me. Hmm. <laughs> well, I'm going to bed early tonight. So I can be up for this eviction tomorrow. <laughs> so she that is a good call. So she make sure you call me and wake me up. Girl, yes, listen. Me. I'm going to burn every family member phone up. She <laughs> said she going to come on Bego. I wish I could film it and send it to his mama. Well, I'm gonna take off also. I'm gonna go to sleep. Okay, I'm sis. not gonna. I'm not gonna Tell go to sleep. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go do cartwheel over the house. I know that's right. <laughs> nah, that no. is something I would love to see, uh, Jerry. <laughs> I'm just saying. Uh, I'm just You're observing. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna cartwheel all over the house. Well, 
I'm like the day before Christmas because I cannot wait till tomorrow. Oh, so yeah. we're not going to hold you, sis. We're going to let you continue your day. And we'll see you right. live tomorrow on the Big You're Billy Skeezer. You take care, sis. Tomorrow is Thank the day. You. And I'm going to make Thank sure you. I get some rest for this. Tomorrow. So did they, they, don't, they didn't tell you what time? No, so it. I think it's the time that they they put it on. I think it was like around four o'clock. She called me. She told me it was on. Okay, cool. So we'll we'll wait it out. All right, just I'm, keep in touch. Now I'll call you in the morning. Yes, ma'am. All right, you Good take night. care. All right, Good night, Jerry. All right, thank you.